Twitter suicide usually refers to bloggers tired of constantly commenting on their lives, closing down their profiles. Now the phrase has taken on a whole new meaning as a promising young Labour candidate commits electoral harakiri after an attack of online Tourette's. Stuart McLennan, 24, was fighting the Moray seat in the north of Scotland. The keen tweeter posted a series of four-letter rants targeting the leaders of opposition parties, as well as contestants on X Factor. Perhaps more surprisingly, he referred to elderly potential voters as coffin dodgers and even swore at veteran Labour MP Diane Abbott. The way Labour handled the scandal provoked a storm of criticism from, among others, SNP leader Alex Salmond. For a candidate representing a political party uh, to insult all of Scotland's old people (laughs) is the most extraordinary thing. And the only more extraordinary thing in that is for the Labour Party to keep him as, as a candidate. That's totally untenable. Mr McLennan was initially backed by the Scottish Labour Party before Gordon Brown had a look at his Twitter page, decided he had to go. Mr McLennan's now an ex-candidate. He's issued a brief apology. The foul-mouthed blog has disappeared from the web. But the case will be a warning for the parties who are all trying to exploit the rising popularity of social networking and blogging sites to reach out to millions of voters. For the first time, the internet could hold the key to success in a general election. But it could just as easily lead to a sudden, spectacular fall from grace.